Hello everyone, this is my MacBook Pro from 2009. Uh, here I'm going to show you my overclock on it. Uh, as you can see, I have Windows XP installed here from Bootcamp uh, from original Mac OS. The program installed to make overclock is NVIDIA N Tune. Uh, you just can Google it. The difference when you install this is this performance sector here where you can do overclock in this case I'll do it to GPU settings because I'm not able to do it to CPU it just give me an error on some parameters so as you can see now is factory frequencies that is respectively core bus to 450 and memory bus 1062 megahertz uh, so just going to put custom and test the normal ones, ok, just apply and then you can do whatever you want so I put 550 on core and maximum on memory bus so you have to test it first I tried to run river tuner from this but uh, I just can't unlock my graphic card to it to make overclock I don't know why I try to put, put some codes on the file that is in RivaTuner that I saw in a forum but otherwise it's impossible anyways to get it so if any of you manage to do it please make me know <coughs> uh, this is the maximum overclock I be able to make it um, if any of you guys can could make a better overclock just make me know or if you have a challenge for me or you want to see any other games or any performance uh, tests tell me I uh, have other programs here like temperature I have other programs here like temperature indicators um, this is the first core, second core and here the CPU load and I have a memory rush program here uh, now it's just making the test to the overclock to see if your graphic card can hold it on or not. Just have to wait. As you can see now the temperatures are getting high now. So it's an 81 but the fans didn't start working yet. The noise you can hear is from the other laptop This is here on my side. Mostra o overclock aí, mostra aqui o. Vai chegar aqui. So once it's completed, you just press OK and apply. So now your overclock is ready to go. As you can see, everything is fine. Just close the application and run your game. The settings I will run on Battlefield Bad Company 2 are everything in low except the resolution. Uh, anti analyzing or anisotropic is turned off, everything is low and off. I'm just going to put some random uh, server here.
So now the fans just start working and I hope it gets cooled down soon enough because if you start the game before the fans start working you probably get really really hot and your game will have some lower performance of course so as you can see the game is pretty pretty filled for a macbook is everything really fine very good play um, the graphics of course are not the best but still very good and for this game is really good. I put just some sniper because when you make use the scope to zoom it to push a lot for from the, the graphic card so it will be better. As you can see is everything really really good. Oh, he just got owned. Oh, now me. But I kill him anyways. So as you can see, it's very very good for a MacBook. It's almost unbelievable with this overclock too. It's very big. Uh, you'll get temperatures really really high up in some hours of playing. But just restart with computer or just let it cool down for a little bit with the game turn off and everything will come back to normal. If you want to watch me playing other game or something, just make me know. If you have some doubts about overclock or some errors on Entune program, tell me because I got some of them too and I uh, just solved them. Everything is running good now. Because of course Apple got some software, some programs to block your access to the cores and that thing. My friend here is playing Medal of Honor. Como é que é o nome? Medal of Honor. Uh, the new Medal of Honor on a Toshiba something. A 300. A 300. And it's playing really, really good. Too. It has more performance than MacBook, of course. Uh, his graphic card is a uh, ATI. 3650 So that's all guys